Well, speaking of things that are not for you. <laughs> so the women's, one of the women's titles now was on display or on at stake with Tony Storm and Jamie Hayter. Jamie Hayter, of course, the incumbent champion, and now she's, I'm t they all the girls switched sides and changed squads. They had an intramural thing going on where they just went back and forth. It was like the old shell game a few months ago. You were like, baby face, baby face. Which one's got the baby face? I can't remember. But Baker and Hayter, who were the heels with Reba, who was the best part of that, and she's gone now, now are the baby faces. And... Storm, Soraya, and Ruby Soso, who were the baby faces that were going to change the game in AEW women's wrestling, have become the heels that everybody hates. And at one time, it would have been a pay per view match if they'd have turned Hater Babyface on Baker. But that window slammed shut on everybody's fingertips. That was the feud that they could have had. That could have been a multi month thing. Hater. With Reba still there, because they were still uh, yes. Brit would still be a heel, so Reba would still be there. Of Hater getting the Brit, that could have been a big thing. They just blew that. Well, instead we have a bunch of small things, and this match was further hampered by I guess Jamie Hater is injured. You know, I can't understand why there's such a high injury rate in a in a promotion like this that puts such a premium on good old pa old fashioned pure scientific wrestling. Uh, but Hater's injured, so they did a quick match to get the belt off of her here, which was basically Soraya and Soso attacking her before the match, injuring her arm, rolling her in the ring, <laughs> the referee getting the okay if she wants to go, ringing the bell. What the fuck? Oh, God damn it. You've just been in a fucking car wreck on the way to the goddamn arena where you're supposed to engage in a in a three-round middleweight fight against the UFC champion, and you come in and the goddamn your arm is limp at your side, you're bleeding from the head, and you're dragging your fucking foot that's turned halfway around backwards, and the referee says, you okay to go? They rang the bell, and Storm won in four minutes. So now who knows how long Jamie Hayter will be out of action because somebody else is hurt because they keep landing on each other. I watched the media scrum, Tony Storm, I have to say, by herself without Ruby and Soraya. I thought she was great as a heel, just talking to whatever that wrestling media, that there's some real journalists there, I'm not going to lie, there's some people that ask reasonable questions, but then there's people that are just complimenting the wrestlers and they want to talk about stupid things and just put over the wrestlers so the wrestlers will smile at them, but she was great in there. And it made me realize just how much they're wasting a heel Tony Storm with Ruby and Soraya. She should be on her own. She was great. She was great. I thought she was great in that media scrum. Yeah, well, remember when she was in NXT at one point, and we said, boy, she looks great, and she can work, and she still does look good, and she still can work, but she's got nobody to work with, and she's in the middle of blech. So it's like she's just kind of in that group of people. 